Today we're going to answer the question, how many solar panels do I need? My name is Charles Fox with Paradise Energy Solutions. And I'm Warren Miller, the Director of Sales and Marketing at Paradise. So Warren, I get this question asked a lot, how many panels do I need on my roof? So we got panels behind me. For the average home, how many panels is a homeowner gonna need? You know, on an average home, uh, we'll probably use about 30 solar panels, but Charles, it all depends on your specific site and your specific location and how much electricity you use. So as a homeowner, uh, do I need to calculate that or, or how is that done for me, that yeah. process? So when we go out and we do a site visit, the first thing we do is we look at your electric bill and we look at your historical usage over a year to get an idea of how to size the system, how big to make that solar system to know how much energy it will produce. So let's say uh, I, I know how many solar panels I, I need, but you know, here there's no sun or there's no shade. Yeah. Uh, so I would assume there's other impacts. So what other impacts are there? Shade would be one. Is there other things that we should consider? Yeah, absolutely. Shade is, uh, is a, an important factor. Obviously, we want to put the solar panels where the sun shines. Another factor is the panels, ideally, we want them to face due south. Mm -hmm. And we want them to have a tilt approximately 25 degrees. So my roof is not 25 degrees, so I should not go solar? Is no, you should more? definitely consider going solar. 25 degrees is an optimal fixed position for where we're located here in the mid-Atlantic region of the United States. But we put solar panels on roofs that have uh, a higher pitch or lower pitch, and they still produce well. It's just a matter of needing a few additional panels if your pitch changes too much. So Warren, we're using different panels today than we did five years ago. They're becoming more efficient. Uh, so the type of panel or the efficiency of a panel would also come into play as we're looking at how many panels we need. Panels have been evolving over the years. And to give you an idea, Charles, when we started doing this in 2009, solar panels were about 14% efficient. Today, the solar panels that we uh, sell range around 20% efficiency. And what that means for you is you just need fewer solar panels or less roof space to get the same amount of production that you used to. So let's say you tell me, Warren, I need 30 panels. Yes. And I have space for 20 panels. What is my solution? Now I'm talking about on my roof. You don't have to cover 100% of your electric bill. You can cover 80% of your electric bill or 70% of your electric bill if you only want to go on your put panels on your roof. But we do have options just like these panels here, Charles. We can put panels on the ground for you, whether it's a ground mount, a roof mount, a carport. We have a variety of different options for your different site. Well, thank you, Warren. Hopefully you found that valuable as you look at how many solar panels you're gonna need. So obviously we're gonna need your electric bill. You know, we're gonna look at your roof or your ground space is available. Uh, the type of panels we're gonna use, all that's gonna be accounted for and, and part of the equation of how many panels you need. 